So we took the Spot GPS Messenger, which is basically an emergency locator beacon out into the wild to see exactly what happened when you push the 911 button. I'd always wanted to push the button. I love pushing buttons. And um, it have been tempting me since I got the first one about a year ago. This time though, we coordinated with Tahoe Nordic Search and Rescue and Geos, the company they use to actually dispatch the rescue teams to find you to make sure that nobody thought we were actually in an emergency situation. We went out in, in the Tahoe area onto a place called Martis Peak. It's an 8,200 foot mountain. And we, we started out in the middle of the night around three in the morning because we wanted to get as lost as possible. And that, and that worked pretty well. I was lost within half an hour. I hiked for another like eight hours trying to find something that I could use as a waypoint, but I really didn't. I was trying to the whole time to conceal my tracks so that the search and rescue guys couldn't find me. I was climbing over rocks mostly and packed snow, and then when the snow, which was about waist deep, I put on snowshoes and dragged a dead branch behind me to actually obscure my footprints. Eventually I got to the point that I, I couldn't really go much longer. Without water and without food, I was really just ready to go home. Have a seat and call in the cavalry. This is the moment. Help me! Help me! I'm, I need waffles! I got a waffle emergency! I pushed the 911 button and they were there within a half an hour. You know, it's kind of cheating because they knew that I was going to be out there and the real, the real response time would probably be a lot longer, but I was still pretty impressed that I was on a completely different mountain than they thought I was going to be on and they still were able, you know, literally within a half an hour I see these snowmobiles come over the rise and next thing I know I'm in a nice warm snowcat drinking warm water. It's great. <laughs>